Okay. Hey. <laughs> so this is another Tareba unboxing. My name is Noelle, also known as Slot Arcade Maven. And I know that this is like really far, far, far away, but can I just tell you that I have five, five Tareba boxes to open, like seriously, for real. And they're taking over my house. So I thought, you know what, I was gonna do separate videos and shoot a couple, but this is Crazy Town because I'm Crazy Town. And so I thought, you know what, let me just do a couple, or uh, one giant video, I should say, unboxing all this stuff. Um, and as I unbox, I will get closer to the camera because obviously this is like, I think my head's cut off and everything else. This is crazy. But I'm going to start showing you all the prizes that I have won over the last few weeks. This, I think, is my fifth Tareva unboxing. It might be the sixth. I don't know. I've kind of lost count. I've got to check my videos. So again, I'm Slot Arcade Maven. Thank you for watching. Share my video if you would, please. I'm trying really hard to gain some momentum with my channel. I will be doing a 100 subscriber giveaway soon. Soon. Um, so like I said, share and like my video. Uh, I know there's a lot of us out there that do slots and um, arcade videos and unboxing, but you know, there's only one Maven and here I am. So um, I'm going to just start. I already opened the boxes in the sense that I've already cut the um, packing slips out and I've opened the boxes physically because it would just take forever so I'm just gonna start and as soon as I get through a box I'm gonna shove it to the side and I'm gonna get closer to the camera so you can see but I'm gonna do my very best to show you everything that I've gotten so far so this is the first of five five boxes so in my box here they're giving me the new July prize list which I'm going to try to when I edit this I'm gonna to try to zoom in for you but it's the new July prize list and it's got things like Hello Kitty and um, uh, Pom Pom Curin and My Melody. There's some, there's some more um, Minions stuff and a couple more Pokemon, which I always like. I'm a big fan of the Disney stuff though. So, and like I said, I don't even remember what's in what box. We're just gonna take stuff out. And right now, this looks like a lot of paper more than anything else. But so here we go. Oh, okay, here we go. First thing I have here. This is a Toy Story sun visor for my car. This one, if I remember correctly, oh, it has a picture. It's got Woody and Buzz Lightyear and the little um, alien dudes, which I can't for the life of me remember what their names are right now. But there was two of them to choose from, and I picked the um, Toy Story one because I thought it was really nifty. Okay, this is super cool. Can you see this, or is it too high? It is the Fire Flower from Mario. The whole flower. It's a giant, cushy, really, really cushy, um, like a rug, I think it is. I think it's really neat. I loved winning that because I love, I just love that. These are, oh, this is so cute. Look at their Hello Kitty flip flops in a cute little zip bag for the beach. I don't know what size they are. I do hope they fit my big size nine feet. So hopefully they will. But these are like super cute. And I was so excited when I won those. This, oh, I love this. This is a tote bag and it's all sushi. All different kinds of sushi on here. Super, super cute. This, is in the bag all together but if I remember correctly I'm not going to take it out well you know what maybe I will it's just the bags are loud but this is a I love this I'm going to bring this camping this is can you see this it's so hard I gotta get a better camera this is a Donald Duck it is a collapsible laundry bag so I thought this would be a totally cute thing to bring camping because if you like to camp like I do, you always have your dirty laundry. It's like, I'm not putting all my dirty nasties next to something that might be clean. So I thought that would be a really cute way to bring everything home and then just throw everything into the, into the washing machine. Okay, you guys know if you've been following my channel, 
You know I have this insane passion for Draymond, but my biggest passion is Doraemon. I just love the character, and I was so psyched when I won this. It is a fluffy Doraemon pouch. They had three different colors, and I remember I won this in one try. I was so excited. It was one of those where you have to just pick the claw, picks it up, and it will tilt it either between the slats. I won it in one. I was so excited. I can't. I can't with that. I'm just telling you. This is, oh my gosh, this is even cuter in person. It's a Mickey Mouse backpack. Like, for real, it's a backpack. I can't. I just, ugh. I'm just going to say it once. Um, Tareva is evil. I love it, but it's evil. This is another clear tote with a nautical type of drawstring. It's Donald and Daisy, and it's clear. I love this because, like I said, I'm a big fan of Draymond, but I'm also a big fan of Disney, primarily Donald Duck. This is a, oh my god, I didn't even know it had a palm tree. I am like obsessed with the beach too. This is a Mickey Mouse umbrella and it says Ahoy and it has a palm tree. I can't with this. And the last thing that's in this box is a Sumo Gurachi knapsack. It's very small and it's, you know, not a very large knapsack, but it's got the handles. And look now, seriously, look how cute. It even has a claw, like in a claw machine. I, I, I can't. I, I can't. I can't even. I just love it. Oh. Not all of this stuff I'm keeping. <laughs> I am giving a lot of stuff away as gifts. I have two nieces and they love all this kind of stuff. So they'll be getting a bunch of stuff. But you know, I might, now that I think about it, my 100 subscriber giveaway. I may just pick something out of all my Tareva wins and give that as a as a gift for my first subscriber giveaway. How about that? That sounds pretty nifty, don't you think? All right, hold on. That's one box. I'm getting closer. Oh my stars. Okay. The next box. I'm still cut off. Hold on. Let me see if I sit. Ugh. I just don't want to be too, ooh, all right, how about that? Okay, so the next one, much smaller box, much easier to handle. Inside are the same papers, packing slip. What is this? Oh, it's Mrs. Potts. It's a little keychain. Um, I am a big fan of Beauty and the Beast. Again, Disney. My other passion other than Tareva is theater and I do musicals primarily um, and I did Beauty and the Beast last year and I love Mrs. Potts so I was very excited to get this because this reminded me of the group I did it with and how much fun we had it was so much fun this is a plushy owl toy just a squishy plushy owl but I love owls and I thought he was super cute this is a, I think it's Relacuma. Again, he is a little keychain, a little thing on it. I think what I'll do with Mrs. Potts is I think I'm gonna put it on my Christmas tree next year just because it looks like it would be able to be hung because of the, the chain on it. I think I will do that. Next in this box, I have a Zoom Zoom tote bag. This one has the Mickey and Minnie front. I also have, and I love this, a Zoom Zoom backpack. And it has all the characters on it. The back is just black, but all the Zoom Zoom characters. I love Zoom Zoom. And then, last in this box is another Zoom Zoom tote, but this time, can you see who's on there? Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Donald Duck! I love Donald. So, I had to actually play the Mickey one to get the Donald one to show up, so I, that's, that's why I have both, because I won this one just so that I could try to win the Donald one. And fortunately, I did, so that was really 
very exciting because like I said, Toreva is too much fun. If you've never been on their website, it's Toreva.net. It's crane, a crane game, they're crane games and ping pong games and things like, like games that you would see at round one. Um, they don't have UFO catchers at Dave and Buster's or anything like that. So it's primarily places like round one that have UFO catchers. So Toreva is based in Japan and you play from the comfort of your own home a UFO catcher or a uh, ping pong game or another type of arcade game live in Japan. It's like the technology is pretty nifty. I've only had a couple of issues and it was on my end uh, last night was one of them actually. I was playing and my modem decided that it, would it was time to take a rest so it dropped my signal right in the middle of a game. So yeah, I lost that prize I was going for. I was not very happy. But that's the first time that that's ever happened and I've been playing Tereba now for about six months, I think. I think since like January. So it happens. But like I said, if you've never tried it, just check it out. You get, I believe you get three and it might be as many as five free plays when you first sign up. So you can kind of get a flavor. Is this something I really want to do? And I'm going to warn you, it can get very expensive. So if you don't have the funds, don't spend it. And if you're under 18, I think you need to get permission, but I'm not positive on that either. But even if you're, even if you don't need permission and you're, you know, going to play this, I would still run it by mom and pop first, just to be sure. Just because even if you get an allowance, you really want to spend every cent of it every single week on Treva. It, like I said, it can get expensive, but it is a lot of fun. Um, this box here, I've got a big plushy, um, I believe this is an ostrich, and I just think it's so cute. I think this one I won on one of the fishing games, I think, if I remember correctly. So that was nifty. This is, I think this is Marie the cat from Disney. Big, giant, super squishy plushie. She's nice and soft. Love it, very cute. Like I said, I have nieces who love this stuff, so they're gonna go bananas when they see all this at Christmas and birthdays. I've got a few little small plushies in here. I've got a dolphin, a little dolphin. I've got, I believe this is a sea lion. I believe, a sea lion. I've got a whale, which I really think is cute because it's got polka dots on it and it smiles and I think it's cute and I think I'm going to have to keep that one for myself. I have a second dolphin. I have two nieces so they get the same thing. And then I've got a penguin, which I thought was really cute. And then, oh, there's one more thing. Oh, this is jewelry. I don't usually go for the jewelry games, but when they're licensed Disney, I kind of get suckered in. And, oh, I can't with this. All right, I have to get close, so hold on a second. This is another um, <laughs> Beauty and the Beast. It's a Mrs. Potts, oh, and it's got chip and everything. It's a necklace. Hold on, let me get close to this because you're going to love this. Look, it's Mrs. Potts. I believe it's the silver one. I think it's got a pink chip in it. Not chip, the character, a pink like this cubic zirconia, but it's a necklace. I, I couldn't help it. I, I I was surprised I won it, so I was really happy because it's really cute. So that was in the box number three. Now I still have these two ginormous boxes. 